I've been with the company a long time, since 2012. You know, right now it's winning this fight and then uh, looking towards a couple main events and go from there. I'm on a three fight win streak right now and you know, when I go smash Kevin Holland, it's gonna make a statement. Putting a stamp on this guy will definitely give me that main event spot that I'm looking for and then, you know, we can negotiate from there. This is a big moment here for Tim Means to be on a three fight winning streak. He's had a lot of ups and downs in his career, but he's always entertaining. I'm known for my striking, but I started off as a wrestler and, uh, and a submission guy. Keep people guessing is uh, what the last three fights have been. He goes in there just trying to put his opponent down. It's as simple as that. I'm going to put a stamp on this next fight. There's a tap! With a cool submission. Uh, first fight at welterweight was against Charles Oliveira. I hit him with a bing, I hit him with a bang. Couple leg kicks in the first round, went into the second round. Legs were numb, face was dead. Oh! Whoa! Huge right hand from Kevin Holland! And that's all they wrote, folks. That's That'll it. do it! Holland blazing his trail at welterweight! Every win in the welterweight division I want, I want everybody from 15 to 1. So whether it's Tim, whether it's somebody else, I want every dub. Every win's important to me. The power that he possessed at 185 pounds will 100% carry over to 170. I'm very, very high in this young man at 170 pounds. I would say Tim's in big danger this fight, just for the simple fact is, you know, and I pack power. I take it up, take it down, no matter where I go. Oh, huge right hand shows us out, Kevin Holland. That power is there. Uh, it's a huge opportunity. He's a guy that's coming in with a lot of hype based on he's 2-0, trying to make a run in welterweight. He made a good run in middleweight. Deflating this guy's balloon will only let me take his power and his, his energy from him and then move on. I think I'm going to crush his hype. And the reason being is I'm tougher than he is hands down. This is going to be a really good opportunity for me to go out there and just completely starch everything that Tim Means has been doing lately. Like, you know, shut that down, show everybody why I'm a true big dog in the welterweight division. I think my style is problematic for Tim and anybody that seems to be in the weight class because, A, they don't have the weight to hold me down. If you got to scrap with this guy, it's a scrap that you will get and it's a scrap that you might not want. My pressure is going to cause a lot of problems for him. I'm going to get in his face, I'm going to box him up from the inside. Kevin likes to strike from way far out, you know, because he has that 80 inch reach but he doesn't like to be in the trenches and we're going to exploit that. Like he said, I'm on a streak, I want to get it back. That's how he's fighting. My personal goal this fight is just to simply look good and while looking good, break some things, you know? Break some people's legs down, break some people's faces down. You know, overall, just break a man down.